There are three different CTE programs at our school. There's computer science, culinary, and there's agriculture. Um, when I first came to the school, agriculture was very popular. My sister was a part of the program. Once I joined the class, I fell in love with it because everything that we do is hands-on. It's hands-on learning. In agricultural education, there's a three-circle model. Uh, classroom instruction, FFA involvement, and what's called an SAE, or a Supervised Agricultural Experience. And essentially what an SAE is, is a student-driven project that kind of focuses a student's uh, interest in agriculture. And being a project-based school, it really ties in great with just our mission statement and what we want to focus on for student learning. So every day, basically we come into class and Miss Bell, our teacher, she'll talk to us for about 15 minutes. We'll go over what we need to do for the day. We'll, we might do some classwork, learning about different agriculture stuff. And then we'll all head outside and then we'll feed all of the animals. Um, actually, since recently the goats have been having babies, so we've been having to milk the goats and then process the milk. And then we collect eggs every day. We learn how to sell the eggs. Basically everything's just back into marketing and business, selling the products that we make, make the products, and then of course we have um, plants out there that we have to plant, grow, process, harvest, and then end up sell. So when we started six years ago, um, you know, I was given a little spot of a baseball field, and the vision was that it would become a, an outdoor learning laboratory, a, a school farm. And we've done that, and I've really made it student-focused so that they are the ones setting the goals. And so they've developed everything out there. They've created everything that is out there. Throughout that six years, we've seen these students come alive with passions that they didn't even know that they had. I really enjoy, you know, playing with the animals and planting. Planting is one of my favorite things. I really enjoy. We did something with goats a while back where we made goat lotion and that actually inspired me to make my business that I have right now and I'm just opening. It's called Blooming Body and I make body butter, body scrub, lotions. I make all of that. The agriculture program at this school has really opened my eyes up to some people who maybe can't afford fresh produce. So my goal is to grow all the fresh produce that I can and give some of that to the people who unfortunately cannot afford that. So obviously if you want to go down the agriculture career path, this program kind of gives you a start to what you want to do outside. But even if you don't want to go into agriculture, it helps you with stuff like communication and real world skills. So my sister went into marketing and business. We have this class called Agribusiness, which teaches you all about learning how to start your own business, learning how to use money correctly, and all the stuff that can help you right when you graduate high school. I've had students go into business, uh, some of the best business schools in the country, because they, they learned uh, marketing and business in an agriculture class. So even if you don't want to go into agriculture and work with animals directly like we do on an everyday basis, you still are learning how to communicate with adults, how to communicate with your peers, and it will better your chances to land a better job. This CTE program has not only launched college careers for many of these students, but also careers, long-term careers, where these students are going to be making good money um, without a student debt. We've seen all of our students kind of go in different pathways, and it's, it's very rewarding as a teacher.